Hey guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to install Siri on your iPhone 4 and iPod Touch 4th generation on iOS 6.0.1. Now yes, you do need to be tethered jailbroken. If you guys have not done that yet, do that now, and there will be a link in the video right there. Go ahead and click it and jailbreak your device. If you are jailbroken, you can go ahead and do this. This is a very stable full port. That means everything works. You can do the reservations, the scores, movie tickets, basically anything. And dictation works as well. It's very easy to install, works great. And I've never had any problems with any servers just yet. But you know, there may be problems later on as more people are using it. But for now, it does work perfectly. Here I am in Cydia. I just wanted to show you guys, I am running iOS 6.0.1 on my iPhone 4. Yes, it does have the same antenna as the iPhone 4S, but that's because Apple updated the antenna in the CDMA iPhone 4. So this is not a 4S. Anyways, let's go ahead and fire up Siri. Siri, what time is it in Chernobyl, Ukraine? In Chernobyl, the Ukraine, it's 11.18 p.m. And Siri, what are the movie show times in Vancouver, Washington? As you guys can see, it does show times just fine, and if I do reservations, that'll work as well. And real quick, if you guys do want to see the dictation working, I will go ahead and show you that it does work. Please write this text message for me, because I am either driving or too lazy. As you can see, it gets everything works great. I've had no problems with speed or the server being disconnected just yet, but like I said, it may not work at times, but that's okay. Anyways, go ahead and fire up Cydia. So you're gonna go to Manage, Sources, Edit, Add, and you're gonna add the following source. It's gonna look just like this, ihackstore.com forward slash repo. Once you have that added, you will see the source right here. Go ahead and click on in. Scroll down to the S's, and you guys are going to want to click on Siri Beta for iOS 6.x.x 6 .6 Beta. Go ahead and install that. It'll ask you to reboot. You want to exit out of Cydia and then open it back up. You don't want to reboot just yet. We're going to reboot at the end once we have everything installed. Next, what you're going to want to install is Siri DR, also in the same repository. So go ahead and install that. This time, do not reboot just yet. We're going to exit out to our home screen, and on our home screen, we're going to see Siri DR. Go ahead and open that up. In here, go to Siri Servers, and you're going to select Siri iOS 6 Server. I'm going to dismiss this. We're going to download the certificate, and this will take us to an external website where we click on the Siri iOS 6 Server. I'm going to wait a few seconds, and then it will go ahead and reload the page, and we're going to install the certificate. As you can see, I already have mine installed, so I do not need to do this, but once you do have it installed, you're set, and go back into Siri DR. This time we're gonna go to Token Fix, and this will open up Cydia. Inside of Cydia, you wanna reinstall the Token Fix because most of you already have it installed. So click Modify and click Reinstall. Once that's done, it'll respring your device. It'll go up into Siri DR one more time, Siri servers, click on it once more and respring. Now after your iPhone or iPod Touch resprings, we're gonna go ahead and go to our computer and tether boot it using Red Snow. Now after your device resprings, you're gonna wanna go ahead and get access to your computer because we do need to reboot our iPhone and since we are on a tether jailbreak, we're gonna have to use Red Snow to do that. So go ahead and power off your iPhone. Of course, most of you guys will know how to do this. It's just tether booting your device. You want to go ahead and go into Red Snow, go to Extras, select your IPSW for your device. Mine is an iPhone 4, so it's going to be the 6.0 version, not 6.0.1. Click OK and just boot tethered right now. Once your device is off, you're going to click Next. You're going to hold the power button for 3, 2, 1, together with home button for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, to one, let go of the power button and continue holding the home button. Once your device reboots, you can go ahead and begin using Siri. Once your device reboots, go ahead and slide to unlock, open settings, and here you want to scroll down to Siri DR settings, and you want to go to Siri settings and enable Siri. Even though it won't stay on, that's fine. Here you can choose which language you want. I'm going to keep mine on English. If you don't get the chime at first after clicking on Siri, you want to go back into the settings and re-enable it. And eventually it will start working. So let's go ahead and try it out. Hi Siri. Hello there. And as you can see, it works great. 
So there you go guys, you now have Siri running on iOS 6.0.1 on your iPhone 4 and iPod Touch 4th generation. So thanks a lot for watching guys, I do appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoy Siri on your iPhone 4 and iPod Touch 4th generation. Have a great day, peace.